Okay, welcome back. And let's check with uh, guides in Shifter. What happens if we have a new, or oh, sorry, an old guide from M MGR 1.0 1 or 1.1? So, just gonna check here. We have a guide that was kindly provided by Rem Remy from uh, Digital Dimension. Thank you so much for, for this guide. It's gonna be very useful for the demonstration. Just allow the guy to load. Uh, it's, the light is not so so heavy, but there is some plugins that I don't have, so it's taking a little longer than usual to load. Okay, so just uh, pop up. Okay, hold on here. Thank you. Okay, so we have a guy here. This is from M Gear 1.1. And the first thing we will know them it's that if we try to build, it's gonna fail. So I'm just gonna build here, and it's gonna start to complaining like I eh, can't find this parameter, can't find this parameter, and so on. There's a lot of parameters that are new for this version that they have some function that we will check on the next another video. But basically, it's refused to build and say uh, the guy it doesn't seem to be updated. Check the log, blah blah. So, and you can check the log here. That's the reason because it's a big login always in M Gear. It's because it's very useful. So, we will see two things mainly. One thing it's it's say I cannot find the control to. That means that here is no control to anymore. Before we used to have a lot of controls. Now this control have all the options that you need, or at least all the options that was before separated in many many components. So we know we don't have control to. Second thing you will note it's can't find the parameter. Oh but enjoying index, oh these parameters are new, I don't know what the hell they are. But it's always the same. So okay. So you don't complain about any other component, just com control two and parameters. Okay, so we have a new um update guide the only thing it's to update the guide you have to f to have the the right components uh to update so basically it's going to update all the components that we have here but if we have control 2 it's not here so it, you don't know how to update and it's going to it's going to delete it basically what it's doing it's parsing all these regenerating all this and if it doesn't find any one of the your your components it's going to delete it so I'm not gonna gonna do it here because I want I want to keep this video short, but basically it's gonna lose some of the components, and I know which components are. So let's go straight forward and just fix that. Well, if we don't know, we can check here. But I remember it's the I somewhere here. Oh, it's Control Two Four. Oh, we don't say the name. Okay, so it's here. I know it's this one. So we need to go on the attribute editor go to the root and check here the extra attributes indeed this it's same thing it's parsing when the new settings attribute but this is not accessible so just take carefully and rename this with the right component it doesn't matter it doesn't have the same attributes it's gonna update as better as you can so this is spine, so we have the locator, this one, this one. And I think this is already control one. And the last one I think it's in the I here, the I or oh, the A I lux I look. I'm sorry for my pronunciation. Okay. So it should be enough with all this and the rest just all checking here. Yeah, this is control one. Okay, so we're good to go. So we select the the guide, the root of the guide and just click update guide and it's gonna do the same it's gonna complain all these these attributes or parameters that doesn't find but at the end it's gonna say okay check the the log and i updated the guide just a few seconds more okay so here we are Oh, the guide is not updated, and the guide is updated. Oh, nice. So we have now everything. It's ready to go with the new 
parameters so everything will work now if we try to go here on the settings we have all the settings like before all the reference array should be working also we have a new new option or new information that you can access through the attribute editor here at the end it's gonna tell you some information about your guide in this case it's generated with the gear version 2.0.3 the Maya that I'm working now and the date and some user information so I hope this is useful I know some people is gonna be happy to see this here and let's try if this will build okay, so let's go to the guide and build form selection here we are and the guide is built and ready to animate or to skin in this case thank you for listening see you in the next video bye bye